Hey, what's going on, y'all? So in this video, we're going to be talking about or taking a look at FaceGood's new 4D facial animation solution. Now, I have talked about 4D facial animation a couple of times earlier this year whenever the Matrix demo came out and whenever Unity's Enemies demo came out because both used 4D facial animation. So a lot of people ask me, what is 4D animation? Well, it is currently probably the best facial animation tool you can use for facial animation and Jello from Facegood just released this a week ago, pretty much explaining how the process is, at least for the Facegood new process that's called NUA 4D. So with that being said, let's go ahead and watch this video because it's pretty good at explaining how this all works out. So let's go ahead and press play. Hello, my name is Jado, founder and CEO of Facegood. Now I will present a new performance capture technology, the next generation of high fidelity performance capture which produce high precision 4D sequences and could be targeted to any title of rig. The name of free skilled NUVA 4D comes from the ancient Chinese myth. NUVA is the mother goddess of Chinese mythology. She is credited with creating humanity and repairing the pillar of heaven. Fiscal NUVA 4D is one of the most advanced facial mocap technology in the industry. There are five processes. The first step is to track the actor's expression and output 2D points cloud features. The tracking accuracy is very high, include all high frequencies, low frequency, and small range motion information. The second step is to calculate the 3D point cloud based on the 2D point cloud. The third step is to reconstruct the 3D dance point cloud. There are many of the 3D point clouds here. Millions, crazy. The fourth step is calculating the face mesh and completely restore the facial expression details, including lip adhesions and a huge amount of micro expressions and subtle motions, etc. The fifth step, retark animation to any rig, which could be polishing and tweaking. Okay, so that is the video of how FaceGood 4D works. Now, I'm not sure if this is how the other companies work, because 4D is not really available to everybody. I believe there's only like two or three uh, companies who are accepting 4D facial animation, I guess selling them if you would, if you would. But this is kind of cool because I think, I'm not sure if you're familiar with uh, the movie Mission Impossible. Early on, I think one or two, they had this crazy idea that you can kind of 3D print a face mesh and kind of wear that as your face. That's where this technology could potentially go in the future, which is super cool. So let me go ahead and have this page up right here. Now this way, this method of facial animation is extremely accurate because as you can see, it's actually creating a face mesh, a 3D face mesh of your facial animation. So it's actually molding your face onto a face mesh as you can see right here. It all starts with you know, just dots and points, and then it gets pointed into a point cloud system and then a mesh, and then you can retarget it to a different rig. I know people will argue that, you know, you really can't beat hand animated characters, but to me, there's just a lot of facial expressions, micro expressions that we do uh, uniquely, each and every one of us, that is kind of hard to do with a hand animating a facial animation. So now again, obviously you're probably gonna know the issues here a little bit. There's no eyeball tracking. I'm not sure how that works out yet, but um, uh, I'm gonna be waiting for more information on that. And additionally, I don't know how much this is going to be because as far as I know, I heard that 4D facial animation that's used right now is like $150,000 per minute or something like that. It's really crazy, obviously out of our budget. So I can probably safely say that it's gonna be out of my budget, but for indie developers, small teams that are making video games or cinematics, for like love, death, and robots and things like that, this is probably something that they can go ahead and take a look at that they can use. So that's pretty much it. That's the 4D animation just for y'all to kind of see how it works. But there's another thing that they uploaded a couple of days ago. They're actually starting to do 
tongue tracking as well, which is kind of crazy. So here is tongue tracking with somebody beatboxing. So check this out. This is kind of cool too. Hello, my name is Timo Schnapp and I'm going to perform a beatbox freestyle. That's pretty, pretty insane. Time MRI. Here we Here we go. Pretty cool. That's so... That's so crazy, man. That's insane. Combine that with 40 facial animation, tongue tracking, eyeball tracking. A future is really starting to look good as far as animation goes. It is really, this is this is some really exciting stuff, at least for me. But what do y'all think about that? What do y'all think about 40 facial animation and now face goods tongue tracking here? Let me know in the comments below. Like always, thank y'all for watching, and I'll see y'all later.